There are a lot of reasons why you might want to think about roasting a turkey breast instead of a whole turkey. Maybe a big bird provides more than your family can eat. Maybe your family prefers white meat. Or maybe roasting a giant turkey is just too much work. A turkey breast solves all those problems. So let's stuff and roast one. Before we preheat the oven, let's put the rack as low as we can make it go. And now we're on to the stuffing. We'll start by sauteing a bit of onion and celery and butter until they're tender. Add your onion and celery to a big mixing bowl along with chopped dried apricots, chopped fresh cranberry, and half a bag of herb flavored stuffing mix. We'll give it a good mixing. Then slowly drizzle chicken broth, a quarter cup at a time, tossing after each addition. To moisten the breadcrumbs, but not make it wet. We'll let this stuffing sit while we prepare the turkey breast. This is an eight pound turkey breast that has been rinsed and patted dry. Let's turn it over. Now use kitchen string to tie this end tightly together and spoon some stuffing into that space. We'll keep spooning stuffing inside until it's full. Don't worry, we will have extra stuffing. Then tie the turkey breast closed in two more sections, like this. Now we'll stand the turkey breast up in a roasting pan lined with parchment paper and sprinkle it with a bit of salt and pepper. Don't forget to always wash your hands after handling uncooked poultry. And now it's time to put it in the oven. Take the leftover stuffing, put it in an oiled baking dish, and cover it with foil. and put it in the refrigerator. Roast the turkey breast in a 350 degree oven for one and a half hours. Then add the dish of stuffing to the oven with the turkey and roast 45 minutes more or until the internal temperature of the turkey reaches a safe 170 degrees. Let's take a look. Wow, this is just gorgeous. Mmm. Now we'll let it stand for about 15 minutes so that it's nice and juicy. Then we'll cut the string and spoon the stuffing from the turkey cavity into a serving bowl with the stuffing from the dish. When the stuffings are mixed, we'll be able to taste the best of both. All that's left is slicing this juicy bird. And here it is, beautiful slices of lean white meat turkey and fragrant fruit-filled stuffing. Prepare yourself, a barrage of praise is about to come your way.